Riveriano Duran says he was working at a restaurant in 2017 when a can of cooking spray exploded, leaving him with severe burns. He's one of eight people who filed lawsuits this week against Conagra, alleging they were injured by exploding cans of cooking spray. Maria Mariani says it happened to her last month. My hair went up in fire and everything else caught up in flames. Six of the plaintiffs say they were using the popular spray Pam, including Yticia Taylor. Her friend called 911. She was cooking and uh, something exploded. As I rose up and closed the oven, there was like a red fog that covered my eyes. And I was screaming like I'm, I'm dying. Taylor says she was left with burns, partial blindness, and lung damage. I'm dealing with my son having moments where he breaks down and just can't get over the fact that I was in a fire. According to the lawsuits, the exploding cans had four U-shaped vents on the bottom. Those vented cans are 10 ounces or bigger, and while they've never been recalled, ConAgra says Pam's vented can design is no longer in production, not because of any lawsuits, but because the company standardized the cans across its product line. ConAgra says Pam is used in 95% of American households and has clear warning labels, adding when Pam is used correctly as instructed, it is a 100% safe and effective product. But those who are suing say the cans were faulty and prone to life-changing explosions. Joe Fryer, NBC News. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.